Bob, I told you, I told you. Thank you for tuning in to On The Lockout. Adam 22, no jumper, Ruger. Apparently, they get into a heated argument. Ruger slaps Thundercats out of him. Bah! Hold that. <laughs> Let me know what you think. Was this set up? Because a lot of people are speculating that this was fake. That they was doing that for views. That they took an incident and blew it up, right? I don't know, because I didn't see it. We were live like at 3 in the morning, and for some apparent reason, I skipped that part. None of us saw it. I didn't see that <laughs> at all. But now I hear that it was lit. So let's check it out. Let's see if you can be honest and say the truth, because a lot of people have a problem doing so. Was this set up by Adam? Being in one part, he says, why speak on it on camera? Adam is looking at him like, hello, <laughs> I'm a podcaster. Cameras is what we do. I just ain't got time to be, you know what I'm saying, bashing the next motherfucker on the internet or whatever. Then the first thing you started the interview off with was, uh, you said you didn't want to talk about the billionaire shit. <laughs> and I literally just told you this. So it's like, why speak about it on camera? I but, felt you want, didn't up. want to talk about Dirk specifically. But listen, this was the thing, though. It's like, even after the interview, I talked to you. I'm like, I don't know. I just want to see the interview before it come out. You know what I'm saying? To see it. You know what I'm saying? Just because I ain't got time to be stirring all goofy shit up. I ain't got time for that. But you, literally, any other time I DM you, you hit me back. But this particular time when I'm DMing you, telling you, like, send me the video, the clip, you're not hitting me back. No. But Adam was like, nah, bro, we posting that. You get it? <laughs> we posting that, put in that work. I need my money. <laughs> I need that money. Facts. Now you drop it. And you knew I talked to you and you agreed upon this. As a man, when you tell somebody I'm going to do this, you got to stand on it. Where I'm from. So, and you ain't stand on your word. Yeah, I should have been more direct and Hold just up. told you I was going to put it out. Let me, let me keep going. I ain't even done. No, it's like. No, no. Oh. Hold on, hold on. Let me keep going. I ain't even done. <laughs> Yo, bro, you got to chill out. We ain't doing all that. You heard? This is my podcast, my show, right? I don't know. And then another thing you want to have plan with oh. folks' mama, like Doug Mama, bro. Oh. Like, I don't give a fuck how much you plan. Don't play with folks OG. Oh. I think that was a mutual thing. Her and I had this I'm little flirtatious to, joke thing going on. Flirtatious joke. Have you, have you seen mama. the interview? She's around with me like that Listen, calling me handsome and all this shit too it's thing. not just like like you remember that day we could not believe the way she was flirting. bro that don't mean his mom's just flirting with you bro a lot of uh mothers from the hood the gutter respectfully all over the world they be like handsome I, hey handsome hey honey that don't mean i'm gonna be like hey yo hey yo i'm saying can i blow your mom's buns real brief my g <laughs> like come on bro you wildin right Hold up, at the end of the yeah, day, nice. another thing, you play with Wooski, bro. Like, oh, just, not Wooski. Hear me out. We, we, we talk. I don't care if y'all talk. That ain't, that, I got a personal problem with it. Because mm. it's the principle of you playing with him about him getting shot in the head. That shit ain't no joke. You, do you know that was at my best friend's funeral? Yeah. Do you know that, that my best friend mama couldn't even bury her son the right way? Mm. I don't think it's set up because at this point I could read body language. This is facts. And Adam looks like, all right, this things got serious right now. Real quick, look at his face. He got the like, yo, I'm not like that look. You heard? <laughs> like, right now I'm scared. I'm respectfully to Adam, you know what I mean? <laughs> but he got the, yo, know, dude, I'm, I just make videos, you know? I'm a creator. Dude, I'm not from the street, you know? <laughs> I just want to talk about it all day. Now, shout out to Adam, though. <laughs> Let's get it. Like, the funeral was completely over after that. My right. father's running everywhere. My mama was there. My son was there. He wasn't even yeah. six months. For sure, Wooski should have thought about that you, before he started talking I'm shit to me. Because when you start doing battle in hip hop, no. you're gonna use Wooski whatever you got you. to talk shit. He you did. When you start doing battle in hip hop, as I keep telling y'all, podcasting is the new hip hop. Hip hop not selling like that. Everybody wanna tug now. Everybody wanna tug. Everybody tug. I'm bugging. Bing, but Adam ain't having it. Look at his face now. He's like, what you saying? He started with me. I'm supposed to be buns and stay quiet. I'm not having it. I'm Adam 22, you heard? Right? That's like the vibe he's giving me. Like, hold up, bro. Y'all think I'm buns? 
Because I'm white? No, bro. I'm the boss here. Get out of my room. What? Yeah, he started shit with me, so I mentioned something bro, like that. You went on an interview with Cairo and brought up Wooski. Right, in a very Blame light way, way. Like, like barely the the idea that that was you that recited, deserved the reaction that you, he then gave me is fucking insane. Just you basically recited lyrics that you knew was really serious, oh, bro. That, like behind the situation, I think you're Listen, you're, you're, you're taking Hold different up. situations and combining right, them up. together, though. Because that was all about Sean Cotton saying but that he didn't think saying. Cairo had Wooski vibes. Listen, when you do that, you place yourself in street shit. Right, it get real after that. Okay. Like for real, gang. Like, like on some real shit. Like, if I would have came in here right now with some, with four pairs of boxing gloves and set the business on the table right now, like, come fight me right now. Let's go fight. Would you? Yo, you gotta chill out, bro. Yo, this dude just said boxing gloves. Are you serious? Bing, bing, bing. Holy snap, my dude. This dude is a boxer. Oh, gloves. Bing, bing, bing. Wow. That's crazy, my dude. Would you box him? Would you box Ruger? <laughs> Would you? Let's see. Keep it stacked. Keep it stacked, homie. Would you box with him? <laughs> Drop it in the comment. He look kind of brawly. He like he been eating a lot of bags of chips. You heard? <laughs> Facts. <laughs> or he been eating them whoop cereals. You know, the, the, the you whooping. You know who that, right? <laughs> the cereal got him, you heard? No, that's just goofy exactly. as fuck. Exactly. That's what I'm telling you. I would have looked at you like you this were doing some I'm stupid ass you. clout shit if you did something like that, when, for sure. Oh. It wouldn't be no clout shit because you ain't going to post it anyway. But this Facts. is what I'm telling you. At the end of the day, if I ask you that type of shit and you ain't really willing to even just fight, don't stop egging it on, gang. Like, if you ain't literally just willing to fight. Why? Like, come on, dude. If you ain't willing to fight, like, just fight. Like, everybody fights, bro. Like, yo, yo, you ain't willing to fight? I, I get a lot of you, bro. I feel right now like Adam is, like, with inside of him. Like, are you serious? This guy wants to fight me? Like, dude, I don't fight. You crazy. I've never had a fight in my life. Fight? What is that? Chill out, bro. He'll fight you with a mic. You're, he'll pot, he'll podcast you to death. Ping, ping. <laughs> Chill out. Now, some real talk, though. Adam might drop him. You'll be surprised. Stop thinking because a dude is white. He can't fight. That's not a fact. Why do you think that... About, why do I need up. to be on board with even, fighting? Listen, like, listen. I never said I was a... Boxer. I'm not even, Why do I need to be a boxer listen, all of a sudden? When you got on that internet and you said, Ruga, bitch, <laughs> acting like a bitch, them fighting words to me. We don't play about that shit. Now, I could come in here and really get on bullshit. You see what I'm saying? Oh. We don't play about certain shit. And you got to understand when you step in that field, you got to accept everything that come with it. Facts. Ain't no, I just want to turn this button off. Now, now I want to turn this button off. Um, I don't want to do this, but no. Nah. You f this is what I'm talking about. You reporting street shit. Street shit is going to happen. Am I wrong? I've been saying that for a long, long time since I was a baby. <laughs> We're getting the other shit that come with it. Do I seem like I'm worried about that? Oh! <laughs> like, do I? Nigga, you, you, you pussy. Do I look like I'm worried about that? Yo, Adam. Like, pop. Wake it hot. What up? It's Adam 22. Again. Do I seem like I'm worried about any of this shit? Listen, like, there's a lot of I threats. Said, there's a lot of ideas. Me, I'm just, chilling. You just ain't said, Stop if I asked you with the boxing glove to fight, you said you would not do it. Right, so you are I'm worried not about a boxer. It. You know why? Because you worried about getting knocked the fuck out. Oh! No, the the it wouldn't be no clout shit, you know why? Yes, it is. Right here, right here. I don't know, a lot of people were saying this seems like it's made up. Right here, right here. It's like a lot of bickering going back and forth. Like I would have been jumped over the table. We don't suggest that you do that. <laughs> but the only thing between us is amperable air, my dude. Like, <laughs> I would have did the, you know what I mean? The Superman. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> oh, you can finish him. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I'm bugging out. 
how no cameras were challenging a non-boxer to a boxing match when I've never said or done no, anything that suggested no that I want to be a boxer. Either. No, what the boxer. Is so different about me and you? You older than me. Okay. What the fuck is so different? I'm going to pull up to do an interview with you and I'm going to bring a snowboard. And we're What's going to have so a different? contest. Who's the best snowboarder? Because that's different? exactly as logical as you deciding that I should be a boxer now. Bro, you just dropped a diss on to people and you was trash as hell. What? Oh, he said his song was trash. He dropped a diss song. That's right. He made a record. Bob, now here's the thing. <laughs> Guys, we got to stop thinking because people bought in to your podcasting situation. <laughs> then now you're the mad rapper because I see everybody trying to rap. I ain't gonna lie, I've been rapping since I was a baby, you heard? And when I freestyle like all that, all my shows in the beginning, I used to rap beatbox like six minutes. Let's go. And let me tell. But I used to do that hard body. Then I slowed down a little. Other people started doing it like it's their flow. I'm like, yo, y'all gotta chill, cause that's biting. <laughs> that is biting. Be biter, don't stop taker. Tell it to your face, you ain't nothing but a faker. You probably wasn't around when that was out. My bad. That was the beginning. But check it out, Adam, yo. The song was I. Right? I never heard it. Let's hear it. Hold up, chill. Bing. <laughs> Of the day, you that might have been the rest first person I heard that say that. Shit. This is what I'm telling you. I heard a lot of people say they think I'm nicer on the mic than you are. Oh, I'm keep it weird, bro. That shit was ass. What? You was ass. That was my first song. But oh, he said that shit was ass. You is ass. That's crazy, my dude. When he starts cursing at Adam, this is what I did see. Instead of the words that he's using, they were putting in handsome. It's so wild. Watch this. But I was like, yo, because I, I did see that part. I didn't see none of this, like, right here. But I seen the part where they, they put the editors, whoever works for him, he puts in handsome. I'm like, who keeps saying handsome? I'm bugging in my headphones back here, like, at 5 in the morning. Like, yo, who keeps saying? I'm, I'm thinking, like, is that lady here? She's calling me handsome. Like, hey, you, what is up? You want to get your buns blown? Nah, I don't know. There's nobody here, though. <laughs> Unless my dog was saying it. You heard? Because my fam had went out, like, kids and all. You heard? They left me. <laughs> I think I snapped. All right, make it your last, man. No. Oh, we got, more. Yes, we got another one that'll probably be out by the time this comes out. All right, that's cool. Keep doing what you're doing. I hope you make it in your rap career. But look, stop playing with people if you're not ready for the outcome that come with the shit. Man. Why do you think I'm not ready? Because you're not. You just sat oh. here and said you wouldn't even fight. So yeah. you're not ready. That's what I'm telling you. Being you're ready not. is not the same as having to take part in goofy ass crowd shenanigans. Some real shit. Air nigga tell you in Cali what they say. We run a phase around. They run phase around this bitch. You hanging out with the wrong guys in Cali. Exactly. But they don't run phase in Cali. Not a lot. Not Whatever a lot. going on. We fight. Where we from, nigga? Chicago. Adam is looking at him like, all right, we shoot shit up over here. You heard? Like, what's up? What you saying? There's no jumper. We get busy. Don't get it twisted. I got money. I get you boom. That's his attitude, I think, you're. That would be my shout out to Adams, though. I don't like bullies like that. Cause I used to be a bully. So looking at this kid right here, it reminds me of who I used to be. Man, for real. It's bad, bro. Yeah, I think he's trying to bully Adam and come up for some clout, right? Yeah, I think so. I ain't gonna lie, sometimes I still could be a bully. I gotta chill out. That's ugly. God I don't like that. Don't do that, guy. Chill out. You big, homie. I mean, that don't mean nothing, but Adam don't want to fight, bro. He wants to help you grow. You're on his platform. If he wasn't trying to help you, you wouldn't be there. These are facts. Don't dispute it. What's right is right. What's wrong is wrong. You bugging out. But I get it. He was talking about a dead dude. But then again, these people shouldn't put the gang business on the internet. This is what we talking about. And then get mad. When somebody disrespects it, you put it there. Somebody put it there. Get at them dudes. You heard? Because this is YouTube, the internet. Welcome to the internet where there is no rules. Next on 21 Jump Street. <laughs> I mean, next on No Jumper. Why I keep saying 21 Jump Street? That was a cop show. Oh, you think they cops? Nah, shout out to Adam, you heard? I like No Jumper. I F with them, right? But I sincerely do. Some people just say for clout. I've been making no jumper content 
since I was two years old. Facts. Go look at the pop, pop, pop. But anyway, what you think about this? Was it set up? Let's check it out, because this is the part where he slapped fire out of him. Back. Well, that's what I heard. At the end of the day, if a motherfucker Chicago fight, this is like very you, different than everything I've been with. Chicago, you really? No, Chicago fight. We who? Yes. When's the last time we heard about a, a famous Chicago brawl? Now you know what it is. Everybody don't be in that. But Chicago shit. fight. I'm gonna tell you some real shit. That's really light. What I'm actually telling you, fight. Niggas really kill fight. motherfuckers in Chicago. Oh, you should kill that's me. what they do. I love but what I I'm telling you is somebody should shoot me. For but what sure. I'm telling you is Adam. Yeah. You're going to get f***ed up one day if you I keep told you. tweaking with people. I'm telling you, bro. I'm going to be real. It's not going to be a good outcome the for you. The threats, the like vague, like, oh, something's going to happen to you. Ain't nobody threatening you. The 22 strain. Bro, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Bob, my dude, you just can't do that. You just can't say if I put gloves on and pound you out and all that, you heard? We run phase, you heard? We... We King Kong over here, you heard? I'll break you up. You're going to get broken up, bro, if you keep talking, you heard? Then you talked about my man. I should have popped your top then. In other words, you heard? Then you play me. You didn't put the thing out. What's up with you, bro? You think it can't happen? We run fades, you heard? We kill people. You can't be saying we eat people that kill people and all that, right? More or less, right? Pop, and then be like, I'm not threatening you. My dude, that is clearly a down low, undiscretional, undisputed threat. The district attorney, when Adam takes you to court, is going to for sure think you've been threatening Adam. And the district attorney is very so white and is not happy that a dude with braids, your her name Ruga, is threatening the poster child for hip hop. <laughs> I'm just kidding, bro. Yeah, I get crazy. Oh, he's not the poster child. Adam is hip hop. Adam is hip hop to you. Adam is hip hop. He's hip hop to me. He's done more for hip hop than some hip hoppers. <laughs> That's crazy, right? Pop, but it's a fact though. A little bit. Oh, I'm bugging. What about 1090? Oh, brat. <laughs> you heard? What's going on here, bro? Holy snap, that's not it. Chill. <laughs> what you doing, bro? You bugging out. All right, let's get to the showcase. Right? Yo, bro, I got things to do. Can you smack him already? Jesus Christ. Get it over with. Trust. I'm Trust telling you. Me. <laughs> I ain't threatening you. I'm good. Oh. I'm telling you. If... If I'm good. Like if you, I sounds like you're trying to threaten me. Fact. At the end of the day, I'm telling I'm you what's real. I'm telling you what's real. Oh, we ain't worried about right. nothing. You don't get f out here playing. No, okay. I'm not. Remo, no, he, he over there looking like. <laughs> Remo, no, 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 no <laughs> homie, nah, homie. Remo looking at you like you not touching this dude next to me, bro. This is facts. This is the dude who pays me. I will pop your top. Think something is keep keep thinking I'm pussy. Remo looking at you like boy. Think I'm just a quiet square from Delaware. I'm going to jump over this table and I'm going to be on you like white on rice. Am I bugging? Remo ain't looking at you like he agreeing. Don't try to throw that in the air. This is what happens with bullies and dudes like us, right? When they try to recruit people in the room. Don't look for no recruitment, bro. It's you and Adam, right? You're the boxer. Stop. Remo looking like he know what it is. Now nah, Remo looking like this nigga pussy bro this is facts i'm keeping it a stack that's my opinion don't come for me boy you heard because <laughs> i know karate <laughs> what nah that's just i don't know karate bro <laughs> you heard i know ninjutsu like how y'all should Remo, you know, know. i'm with whatever listen, i get though. myself into but listen you not because you said you wouldn't even fight a person you that's talk, goofy as you fuck. talking about some clout oh listen, i'm gonna give you boxing you gloves some like shit. that's some goofy ass clout shit and you know it you know it. really saving your face you know it saving your face but no. listen, this is what i'm saying they talking too much so that was made up to me because i'm listen maybe i got a super short fuse but when it started, it would have happened. You heard? These are facts. You heard? So that's it. That's kind of crazy right there. Like, they've been arguing for, like, the whole episode. <laughs> like, chicks. <laughs> With ping, ping, ping. Right? Now, 
Hopefully, this is where the smack is coming in. I don't know. That's what I heard. Oh. How am I going to sue you when I got way more money than you? Because you That's soft. That's not usually how it works. Because you soft. So you telling me if I hit you in your mouth, you ain't going to sue me? I don't need to sue you. You ain't asking my question. Am I going to sue you? Why would I sue somebody that I have way more money than? If I hit you in your you mouth, bum? then what? Yo, in other words, you bum, right? And my bugging son, in other words, he's like, you's a bum, my G. I got more bread than you. You heard? You've been rapping all your life. You've been in the street all your life. You hear your, 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 your shines jingling, you heard? I got more money than you, bro. You not me. You not like that. <laughs> you heard? You not like me. <laughs> Facts. That's a violation. I'm bugging. It gets worse. Facts. I feel like that would really betray the fact that you told Remo that you didn't have a problem with me and really just wanted At to talk on the podcast. At the end of the day, the, the principle. I'm telling you something. You need to learn something. So you're scared of getting sued You need to learn now? something from another grown man. You want me to do it? Sure. Because if I hit you, hey, go crazy. Hey, hold on. What do you say? What, what else is he here? At least, Adam is, at least Adam is not like straight, like super pussy. He's like, go ahead, go crazy. He's saying, go crazy. Bro, you cannot, you're just not going to be saying go crazy. I would have got on that table and started doing the WAP. You heard the Harlem Shake. I would have been like, you, you remember Bobby Schmurda when he went to the thing pop to get signed and he was dancing on the table? <laughs> I would have did that. You heard like I was in Empire. <laughs> Facts. <laughs> but on some Kung Fu, Bruce Lee shit, you heard? Butt naked. <laughs> did I just say butt naked though? That's weird. With his gun. What else is he here Your security going to come in with his gun? Why else is he here? All right, well, see, look. Look. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Well, hold on. So stop talking. If you were really on some tough shit, you wouldn't care about that, right? Listen. Oh, I don't put myself oh, on some tough shit. I've never came on here and told I wouldn't even I am get no the best fighter. When you. have I ever came on the podcast and said, oh, I'm the toughest? It's the shit you mentioned. It. Like I what? just told you. I just spoke on my homie. Fool. Your example you spoke on that is shit basically like telling that me was a game. that even Stop though Wooski dissed me at and talked shit day, to me first, that I shouldn't man, be able to talk back shit. to him in you response. You did that shit. You throw the rock and you had your hand. I, I get true. it, though. I get what Adam is saying because a lot of people do that on these platforms. I'm going to keep it a stack. Prime example, real brief. Let me get two seconds out of your time. You will not regret it. This is ill. Check this out. Bob, so whoever knows, knows that we've been telling Rikers Island story, prison story, gang stories, right? For years, for over 15 years, right? The foundation kind of like set the trend for Bob to open doors. Facts, New York City style. You know how we do. Isai. So, bang, when that happens, Bloods, Kings telling their stories. Now, the Bloods start going hard. Ping, 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 right? A lot of... Things are put in the air, a lot of lies, uh, history became his story, you know, it's changed, Boop, reverse. now the kings became the bad people, <laughs> when nobody in the world remembers them for that. <laughs> you get it? Like, the people that were robbing people in the jails, in all houses, and all buildings on Rikers, were bloods. They were the oppressors, always. That's why nobody wanted them there in the early 90s. So people take offense to it, meaning I'm not talking about the bloods today like you, right? And most of my peoples is that. That's just the fact. People thought I was blood. But another king, not me, because they never do it to me. <laughs> this is just facts. But I've had like a, one or two comments that were wild, right? Now, because the king will start saying... Yo, I remember I took this blood, ping, ping, ping. We put him through the washing machine. I ripped him, pop. He ran to the CO and ratted. Now it's like, bro, you're lying. You heard you pussy. You heard, ah, uh, y'all ain't like that. You heard y'all lost. We was running through you. You heard everybody want to be a, like a chick, right? Boom, but hold up. When y'all tell your stories, nobody saying nothing to you. Let that bro tell his story, right? Because... We know your story was made up. The whole world knows that. And nobody's saying nothing to you. In fact, they're like, good story, you're, you're a storyteller. <laughs> you're just into fiction stories. <laughs> Everybody's story is different. Everybody's way of storytelling is different. Some of these guys pick the genre of fiction. <laughs> you get it? <laughs> that doesn't mean the story is not real. In his head, it's real. But it's fiction. Now, when another dude is giving you real history, 
his story is not valid. Oh, he can't say that. You can't do that. Why, nigga? Because you the big blood or the big whatever, respectfully. Nobody gives a fuck about that. We all was the same. Gang, gang, you heard doing us. Ah, nobody worries about none of that. But in your head, you run the world. It don't work that way, bro. So I get what Adam is saying. That's all I'm saying, right? And no disrespect to nobody. It is what it is. Because, again, you will take that and run with it. Even though I don't care. <laughs> you heard respectfully. But I'm not here to edge on nobody or, 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 or ruin your day, you heard? May you have a blessed day and a blessed life, you heard? Stay away from gangs, stay away from the streets. And when you podcasting, I always told people for years, be careful what you say if you're not like that in real time. Because when you report gang shit and street shit, gangster shit and street shit is for sure gonna come your way. Bop, that's a fact. Let me know if you think I'm wrong. So look, we we talked it out. We said that everything was cool. Yeah, hey, why, Adam, how you man. I this seen the Yeah, you Listen. try to do the old switcheroo. Who want my act tough you as soon as I get on the, the podcast? Police. Oh, I can handle my own business as well. Don't Come worry. On. Yeah, I don't handle it by doing boxing matches with cavemen who want to act tough man. instead caveman. of doing a podcast. Now he racist. I'm not a boxer. Now his racistness coming oh, out. And now you're, you're gonna deploy the race you're card. You're talking about cavemen. You racist, man. I'm describing your brain. You weird. Not your race. You weird. I'm going to ask you to leave. That's cool. Oh, that's, that's right. right. Get the you, fuck out, you my bitch. I don't oh, care. Yeah, yo, that's a handsome guy. Yo, yo, look. I told you, handsome guy. Who's saying that? <laughs> Come on. Handsome guy. Nigga. Come on. Sure. I'm going to get up out of here. Don't touch me, though. Gonna, yeah, you're going to have yo, to go. That's a handsome guy. You're going to have to go. I bet Come you, on. y'all, he, hey, he delete this out. I You're bet you gonna have to go. out the interview. You're gonna have to go. You're a handsome guy. Capable of acting Shut like a handsome guy. Glass up. You I can't act like a handsome guy. I Behave like a grown up. Handsome. Shit. Behave like no, a grown up, Ruga. Come on. Get man. the f out. Touch you? Get out of here. You scared. You're fired. Who's a handsome guy? Your ass up. Handsome guy. Handsome guy. Get the you got a soft ass security. We're not, oh, okay. oh, my son. That's crazy. Come He's on. soft as hell. Come Get out of here. I'm a, we hey, can run the fray. We can yeah, run the fray. Don't do that. Don't do that. Hey, hey, look, come on, y'all. No, no. no. Hold up, hold up, hold up. That's right. I'm soft. He's trying to tell the Spanish brother, like, I'm soft, so he pulled on him hard. That's right, homie. Let's get it popping. I'm soft. Wop, so now it's lit with me. You heard? Now, I was doing my job. Now, I'm going to show you what's popping. Dudes think because of dude's security, he's soft, like he's trying to be a cop. Nah, bro, that don't work that way. I'm a security guard. You heard facts. At Starbucks. <laughs> Yo, that's crazy. You think he did that for clout, though? Look, man, either way, it's bad. You heard? I think the guy, Ruga, is probably a good brother. He's trying to make it himself in life, right? Now, you got crazy, respectfully, people out there that take things to a different extreme. You might have a radical fan that really adores Adam and don't like when people of our nationalities, races, or whatever disrespect a white dude. I'm just saying a quick scenario. It may seem far-fetched or crazy, but they do happen, and it's just a fact. So now you walking down the street, and pop, you get hit in the head. Nobody knows why you were shot, why your life was taken. But it was over this episode and you disrespecting Adam 22. These are just facts. But Adam don't know the guy. The guy just loved Adam. He watched him all day. Vice versa. Adam, Ruger could have a fan, a cousin, somebody that's in the same gang gang and be like, he violated the bro. And the codes is the codes. Whether you on a podcast or not, we going to end this. Adam, you know, getting too loose. And I told you, something is going to happen. It took kind of long because nothing really happened here. It was an argument of two grown men acting like kids, right? Uh, at the end of the day, does it make for good TV? I don't know, because it makes me wonder now. Are you really soft? Or is Vruga the soft one? Because you did a whole lot of fussing, but did a whole lot of nothing. <laughs> Shout out to Ruger, though. <laughs> Bing on the lockout. Thank you for tuning in. We here daily. Plus, we live after this. Here and on Golden Culture with a K here on YouTube. Bing. Love is love. Leave the comments. You think this was set up? I don't know, bro.
I don't know. Maybe, right? It looked a little bit. It did look a little bit. Yo, Flacco, what up? <laughs> get them gloves. Get them gloves. Ping, ping, ping. Oh! <laughs> 